March 29th, 1996, I went to see the Reostatics play at the Art Gallery of Ontario to release their album, Music Inspired by the Group of Seven. It's hard to really describe the impact because it was the very first experience of its kind that I ever had. I followed the band throughout their career from that point on. What really stayed with me was Martin's voice because I really uh, looked up to him in terms of singing style and, and virtuosity on the guitar. Another round, drying off and collecting. I definitely tried to emulate him Where in my own singing. first interest is nature. I mean, that's what's good about this country. It's got space. That big stretch from Toronto to Thunder Bay. <laughs> when you finally see, well, if you're coming back the other way and you've been going from Winnipeg oh, yeah, yeah. straight and you finally see water at the end of Thunder Bay downtown, it's like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Wake up, raise the curtains, let me deep eventual I'll just do it to you. You, do, you keep it down for the first verse. Mm. Mm. Wake up, raise the curtains from your deep provincial eye. Speak out, for I'm certain it's no disguise. The imagery in, in their songs, it's all about this just vast country that we live in that's mainly land. Even though I don't do that as much in my music, it, it definitely resonates with me. I may not show it as much outwardly, um, but inside I'm just a huge fangirl, you know? It's just, they were my Beatles, in a sense. Tell how far the land does go Till it hits the shore Land home 